But we begin with one of the largest fundraisers of its kind, returning to TCF Center after a COVID hiatus. The NAACP Fight for Freedom Fund Dinner brings thousands of activists and political leaders together right now. The theme for this year's dinner is Don't Rest on Your Freedom, with a focus on voting rights and racial discrimination. Victor Williams is live in downtown Detroit tonight. And Victor, we know this is the 66th year of this event, and the NAACP is saying the pandemic really heightened many of these issues. Sandra and Steve, that is certainly not the case any longer. Take a look. It is now a packed house right here at the TCF Center as everyone enjoys their dinner. And I can tell you guys, the food looks amazing. But this is, like you guys just said, the 66th annual Fight for Freedom Fund dinner. And in AACP president, the Reverend Wendell Anthony, along with other higher ups in the organization, along with political leaders just prior to the event, spoke about how great it feels to be right back here and not in front of a computer screen. Tonight, we come back in-house after a year and a half of battling the dreaded COVID-19 virus. Our hearts and our prayers are with all of those who have lost loved ones and who have family and friends who are now ill from this deadly disease. I know from personal witness the havoc it has wreaked on our community. Nonetheless, in the words of Maya Angelou, and still we rise. And it certainly seems like the big names are all here tonight. Like we did say just moments ago, political leaders are here, but of all races and ethnicities making themselves present for this traditional event. Now, as you guys may have just seen, Governor Gretchen Whitmer is here as well, speaking on why exactly this organization is still necessary today. You know, it's just great to be here. I'm so glad that Secretary Fudge is here to to address the crowd. I'm so grateful to spend some time with Senator Sabanow and Mayor Duggan and, of course, Reverend Anthony. Um, but, you know, this is a an ongoing fight, and Lieutenant Governor Garland Gilchrist and I are going to lead the way as we work to protect people's voting rights. And, of course, we are going to remain here for the rest of the event. We will keep you guys posted and updated on anything newsworthy that may take place. Victor Williams, Local 4. All right. We'll see you later tonight. Thank you, Victor.